Happy New Year 2012. Um, welcome to Crown Martial Training's first official technique of the week. Over the next 52 weeks, we'll be doing one technique. Uh, we'll be demonstrating, breaking down either a fitness technique, or strength and conditioning, Muay Thai, or a boxing technique. Uh, we're doing this in hopes to uh, help people uh, with uh, any kind of uh, form or or technique that they're working on for their fitness or martial arts needs. Uh, sometimes people ask me about footwork, so today I'm going to address the, our first basic uh, technique. Um, it's our, our footwork drill. It's our step and slide six count footwork drill. Okay, uh, I'll be doing it. Uh, I'll demonstrate from a righty stance and also a lefty stance. Okay, so from a righty stance, uh, obviously you first need to have a, a basic stance. Uh, if you're righty, right leg back, chin down, hands up. From here, uh, first count is one, two to the back, three, four, five, and six. Okay. From a lefty stance, left leg back, same thing. One, two, three to the right, four, five, and then six. Okay. So now let's break it down real slow. We'll break it down into steps. First step, number one, I'll face off to the side. It's a step and slide. You're going to step with the front foot. If you're going forward, slide the back foot, okay? Stepping backwards or retreating, I'm going to step with the back leg, and I'm going to slide the front foot, okay? And always come back to your stance. Try not to bring your feet together and leave you off balance. Always right back to your stance. And obviously, you don't want to go too wide either. Right back to your Muay Thai stance. Step number three, I'm going to step to the left, step and slide. Again, step into the right. I'm going to step with my right leg again. Step and slide. Number five, it's a pivot. I'm going to swing my shoulders and my hips. And I'm going to pivot on a 90 degree angle right back to my stance. And number six, I'm going to pivot right back to my start position with, a, with again, a 90 degree angle. Okay? So again, at full speed, one, two, three, four, five, and then six, okay? You should hear your feet stepping and sliding. If you want, you can say it in your head. Step and slide, 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 okay? Let's try it from a lefty stance now for the, for the southpaws out there. Obviously, again, right leg forward, left leg back, hands up high, I'm protecting my chin. Step number one, right leg is gonna step, I'm gonna slide the back leg or the left leg. Stepping backwards, I'm going to step with the left leg, slide that right foot back to my stance, okay? Step number three, this time I'm going to step off to the right. So I'm going to step with the right leg, step and slide. Step number four, step into my left, step and slide. And now this time, instead of a right pivot, I'm going to pivot my left shoulder, pivot on a 90 degree angle, okay? Back to my stance. And then number six, step and slide back to my start position, okay? So again... The way you would use this is to set up your offense or even your defense. So now I'm just going to move around with my footwork. Moving around, using techniques. All right, I might step and slide back. I might pivot. I might step and slide forward. Fire and kick. Back to my stance. Step and slide. Jab. Push kick. Switch knee. Stepping and sliding. Always using my footwork so that I don't leave myself off balance or in trouble. Same thing for the southpaw. Step and slide, round kicks, jab, knees. Again, step and slide, step and slide. Okay, this footwork will keep you out of trouble and it'll help you set up your offense. So I hope that helps you guys. Practice, use it in shadow boxing, use it in sparring, use it on the bags, and it'll become a part of your arsenal. Thank you.